What is going on everybody out there in YouTube land? Welcome to another video here on RHC TCG. Yeah, it's been quite a while since my last video on this channel. Probably a good six or seven months. I don't even know to be honest. I think year February or March. Let's not record a video here. I've been live streaming a lot more than making videos just cause for convenience. And also, I've been doing a lot more on my main channel, the main Revolution of Cowboy channel, alongside my joint channel with J. Russ Productions, known as REC and JV Live. Plus, I've been doing a lot of double slash triple streams where I'll do one live stream on two or three different channels, which this is one of the channels I was doing streams on alongside the other two channels, but I may cut back on doing live streams here. So that's the little channel update part, um, and I'll probably talk a little bit about the future of this channel going forward later on in the video. But I know what you guys came for. You gave us a pull one card openings. So here we go. Up some packs. Luckily, I found our sellers playing pull ones packs in stock. They have plenty of the Storm Shield base, which they keep getting more of this as of late. Which, okay, I guess there's still cards I need, including. Well, I don't need the Gold Zashi anymore. If you guys go and watch one of my live streams, or I'll try to upload a clip at some point on this channel, I finally pulled the Gold Zashi. Now, of course, you see like a regular Zashi back there. That's not the Gold Zashi, obviously. And that Gold Zashi is in a binder, but. That's just an extra Zashin I pulled. I was like, you know, we'll just have it in the background for the heck of it. Maybe for some good luck, all of the other cards I have back here. But there are some cards I do need to pull, and not only just Sword Shield Base, but uh, this set right here, Brilliant Stars. I have opened these only in live streams now. I'm opening these on, on camera, so in a video. Hopefully I'll pull any one of those Charizards, or maybe some more character, trainer gallery cards. And then right here... I opened up four of these previously in live streams. Now I opened one in video. The Infernate V Showcase Box, which has the Infernate V card. Of course, you got three packs, two of them being Lost Origin, one of them being the uh, Astral Radiance, which still a chance to pull that Misty card at some point. My girl Misty there in the background for good luck, hopefully. So, yeah, I think we'll get to the Sword Shields base stuff first. And, guys, I'm going to change things up. There was no intro, there's going to be no outro, no music. No edits to really be made unless I have to cut the recording for any reason. So I'm just going to go back to basics for the time being. Just more convenience in a way. Alright, so guys. Nothing too special really with Sword Shield Base. There's only a few cards I still need in the way of Ultra Rares. And maybe some Reverse Hollows. Otherwise, I've pulled almost every card in the set by now. There's few, still a few cards I need to get in the set to complete it. But other than that, I'm practically almost done. And really now I'm really on hunt for the gold and full arts of, of Zon Zenta now. I've got both the full arts and golds of Sashin. So let's see what we got here. Oh, right you. So yeah, guys, uh, bear with me real quick. Sorry, there was something flying on the code card. But uh, there you guys go. That's a code for you. Please forgive me if you guys see, saw some air freshener on there. Um, There's a little bug flying around and I was about to kill it. So uh, yeah, there you may see a live insect death on here. <laughs> No, no, I'm just kidding, but uh, I'll I'll cut the camera for anybody that doesn't want to see that on camera. <laughs> I just made a little joke there. That's just a joke. Not really. I can't stand that. I've been trying to film this video for a while, and Nat keeps flying around here, so... It's summertime where I still am. Fall and start for another week. And also, for a week, I probably won't be able to go back to Family Dollar, because my Family Dollar is getting ready to do a remodel. I was going to do a video for my uh, other channel, but the Family Dollar was kind of busy. I was like, well... I guess people can go back and watch my videos on the main channel. And also on this channel, I have some Found Dollar related videos too. So if you guys want to go back and watch them. And then whenever I have a chance to film my Found Dollar after the remodel, you guys can see how it looks compared to how it looked previously. But guys, I'm going to go through this pretty quick. Because these cards everybody's probably seen like a million times already. First Hall Ghastly. And Lapras V. I still need the VMAX. I still need the Rainbow version. I've only been lucky to pull the... Um, the one in Shine Fates, but that's alright. So there you go. It's at least got a hit for the time being. I don't expect anything too special out of Sword Shield Bay, so... There's a code for everybody that's hunting them. And if you guys watch my live streams, my, my pal, j Rose Productions, he'll do this funny little thing where he does a little auction. He'll probably be in the comments probably saying, Sold to the man in the baseball cap, or sold to the girl in the sunflower dress, or... Sold to Pat McAfee. <laughs> he'll, he'll make a lot of jokes. And yeah, you guys see wrestling boxes back there because I've also do a lot of wrestling pack openings. So, uh, well, mostly in my live streams, I try to do wrestling and Pokemon. So, yeah. 
That's how I've been changing things up a little bit with the, you know, with the live streams going forward. But I'm trying to do videos here every now and then. Hopefully you guys will see this video. If I don't decide to scrap it for any reason. I don't think it's quite quick, like I said. I'm not going to name every Pokemon, but, um, yeah, Corviknight. Nothing too special in that pack. And there's another code for you guys. So we're halfway through the Sword Shield base packs. Like I said, not expecting anything too special. It's a set that's been out now for almost three years, so it's like, I'm pretty sure everybody's had their fill of the Sword Shield base set. It's still a good set, but... One card I still need to pull, but I didn't pull in the Gold Zacian. Well, not the Gold. The Gold Zacian is it, not Zacian. I need to pull that Full Art Marnie at some point. And I don't think I'm going to have anything in this pack, because I accidentally looked at the back of the code card. When I wasn't trying to, but, um... Yeah, let's go through quick. Fight Energy, Energy Switch, Dottler, Glaring Stunfisk, Zigzagoon, Glossifer, the Cobra, Yamper, Krabby, Conyoverse, and a Poltergeist. So, once again, nothing too special in those packs. That pack there, we've got two more to go, and then, hey, Brilliant Stars. At least Brilliant Stars, I'm always happy to open that set. Any chance for a Charizard? Five of them in that set. And, hey, Lost Origin coming up, I will be... I have a chance to get a Charizard in that set, the Charizard of Leon, but Astral Radiance, that's the one I'm really looking forward to, because I want that Stormy V with the Misty on it. Misty's my girl, so, ugh, fucking stop being taunted. Alright, guys, so here we go, Side up Energy, Pow Pad, Citrus Berry, Quillfish, Sobble, Rhyhorn, Rosalia, Pharaoh Seed, Krabby, Reversal Turtonator, and a Thievil. Wow. So rough in these packs. I'll be happy if my Fandar doesn't have any more. I just buy them, just dump my Fandar out, but really, because nobody else wants to buy them. And I've been hoping and hoping they'd get some other sets besides Sword Shield Base and Rebel Clash. Like, man, where's some Darkest Blades? Where's some Vivolts? Why have you go to Walmart and Target? I go to Walmart every now and then, but I haven't been to a Target in quite a while, because we don't have Target that close to where I live. The first, closest Target to me is like nine miles away. So, yeah, and I don't really always have a chance to get out with how things are nowadays. My work schedule. But anyways, guys, last pack of Sword Shield Base. And then I'll be moving on over to Brilliant Stars before we get to the Infernate V-Box. So I'm just going through these pretty quick. Got Chinchow, Scizopede, Glaring Zigzagoon, Mana, Versal Cinderace, and a Cramorant. Only one hit out of Sword Shield Base. And probably could be my last Sword Shield Base opening for quite a while because... Obviously, this set has been done to death, and um, I'm like, yeah, other than the cards I'm trying to find, everything else, if it's affordable, I will get it through eBay. But now, guys, let's get into some check lane blisters here. Uh, Brilliant Stars. I've been lucky to pull any of the Arcuses in the set. I think the only one I've yet to pull is the gold, but I pulled the rainbow, I pulled regular V Star, I pulled full arts. So, yeah, here, of course, the code for everybody wants an Eevee. There you go, get what you can. If it'll focus. I'll put that off the side. And then, open this pack here, Wismacod on the front. Hey, at least this set gives me some hope, because even if I got a code card that's, you know, not going to give me a hollow or better, at least in the reverse hollow spot, I still have a chance of pulling a character rare. So we'll see. I've been lucky to pull some good character rares in the trainer gallery. Alright guys, grass up energy. Charon's Care. Bear Arctic. Collapse Stadium. Bidoof. Electabuzz, Halucha, Weasel, Gibble, Reverse Hall Executor, Snow Trainer Rare. Ooh, -hoo, yes! A Charizard! Hey, anyone the fire? Anyone the. Yeah, that is awesome! You know what? Charizard Sleep, maybe the only Charizard we pulled the video? Finally! By the way, guys, my, my main channel, I pulled the Charizard in the Pokemon Go set. It wasn't the Raiden Charizard, it was just a regular Charizard Hall in the Pokemon Go set, but wow! I pulled a Charizard. Too bad my pal Josh Russell's not happy. He'd be, he'd be getting a soundboard. You know, had the fans say, this is awesome. Yes, it is. Oh, man. I'm kind of regret I do this live. But that's all right, hey. Even if I don't get that many people watching the video, still, it's on it's on film, basically. Uh, <laughs> or whatever you want to call it nowadays. We don't use film anymore, but uh, whatever. Well, we just pulled him. So, hey, that may be the best pull of the video so far. Wow, Charizard has been pulled. I'm not gonna, you know, say there's another chance of a Charizard anytime in this video, because that's it. I I don't expect another one, but we'll see. Stranger things have happened. 
Wow, Charizard V. Awesome. Now I just gotta pull the V Star, any one of the uh, the full arts, the rainbow. But at this point, I got Charizard V. I'll take it. Anytime you pull a Charizard is an awesome thing, guys. So Fight Type Energy, Probo Pass, Team Yells Cheer, Chinsino, Impidimp, Magmar, Riolu, Burmy, Star U, Reverse Hall of Magmar, and Star Raptor. Okay. Like I said, <laughs> I don't expect to pull any more of the Charizards in this video. I'm not trying to jinx it, just being a realist. Because everybody knows your chances to pull a Charizard are very, very unlikely. But sometimes you could go with an entire opening. Or, like, our Pokerep opened up like thousands upon thousands of like Lost Origin packs and did not pull the Alt Arts Aerodactyl V. So, yeah. <laughs> You can almost get almost every card in a set but one. And it doesn't matter how many packs you open. That's just how bad these odds can be sometimes. So, yeah. Oh, man. Charizard V, though. Like I said, that may be the best pull of the entire video. I'm not trying to jinx it. Just, just being a realist, like I said. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's see what we get in this pack here. Still have yet to pull a Trader Gallery card in any of these packs. A so Warped Up Energy. Trophius. Morgrim. Claydol. Duskull, Farfetch, Ex Execute, Grimer, Sneasel. Oh, okay. I've pulled this card before. Alt Art Oranguru, or Trainer Gallery card. Okay, not bad, not bad. And Electivire, not all rare. So, all right. I still need some other cards. Seems like I, like, do you see, like, the B back there of Phalanx? I pulled that card before, and over in um, Asheragus, I pulled it twice. That's why I have another one of, of her back there. But, hey, that's all right. It's always cool to pull another trainer gal card. I like that girl in the background in the hammock while Ranguru has his fan out because, you know, it's hot out, so you got to keep yourself nice and cool. Of course, as you get closer to fall here in my neck of the woods, the good old US of A, while on the other side of the world where my pal Jay Russell Productions is because he's in the southern half of the world, they're getting ready to be, have springtime. So, yeah. <laughs> I hope there's Charizard. Hey, at least Charizard has a mock us today. He pulled a Charizard. So, <laughs> Hey, take what I can get at this point, guys. I don't expect any more Charizard hits in this whole opening. But then again, like I said, Stranger Things have happened. Like, I mean, go back to my live stream on my main channel. I pulled two Arceuses, one being a V-Star, the other being a full art. So, yeah, it can happen. Not likely, but it could happen. I could pull another Charizard at some point. All right, Water-type Energy. Got a berry. Clang. Torkoal, Shroomish, Piplup, Turtwig, Starly, Mincino, no trainer error in this car, this pack here, Cupshu, Torterra, Holographic, alright, not bad. I've already pulled like a decent amount of Torterras already, and and I almost at one point didn't even know it was a Holographic until I looked back at it later on watching my replay of one of my openings, so, yeah. <laughs> Which I hope with the new Hollows that they're going to be coming out with in the um, Scarlet and Violet sets in the beginning of the year. Hopefully they change the hollow pattern at some point, because, man, I love that they still kept the hollow pattern for foils when it comes to, um, you know, any promos you get with check lane blisters, but in the, the regular sets, the hollows are just kind of, eh, okay, but wait, let's hope they go back to, an, to that hollow design at some point. One could wish, but anyways, guys, here we go. There's a code for another Flapple. Shaman Pack, which I have yet to pull a Shaman in any of these. I could, I think I pulled a Shaman V, but I have yet to pull a V-Star. So, I don't know. We'll see. Hey, what's we caught V-Star? I'll take that if I get it as well. So, I don't know. Take what you can with these packs. All right, Light, light Dive Energy, Hunting Gloves, Vibrava, Cafe Master, Weasel, Halucha, Throw, Sock, Cherubi, no trade rares, you got Impidimp. And Tornadus. Non haul rare. So, doing okay. And, um, like I told you guys, you might see a live insect death at some point. Sorry, guys. Please bear with me if you heard the little background. I was trying to kill a gnat. Like I said, it's still summertime where I am. S still pretty hot. Even though things should be cooling down. So, uh, yeah. Bear with me if of any. I need interruptions if I have to cut the record off at any point. <laughs> hey, at least my cat hasn't jumped in the video. Boy, um, Rescue's actually, you know, if you guys see my, my cat, he's about three years old now. 
He's at least starting to behave himself a little more, for the most part. I mean, cats, they do what they want, you know. You can't really control what a cat does, like you can with a dog. But whatever, I love my my, my furry son, as I like to call him. <laughs> Alright guys, can we get some last pack magic here for Brilliant brilliant Stars before I move into the Inferno box? I mean, obviously, we got some first pack magic, so at this point, whatever I can get, I guess, that's fine. If you got Fighting Type Energy... Monferno, Bear Arctic, Fracture, Magmar, Burmy, Sock, Cherubi, Riolu. I think I may have something, but it's not the reverse hall. Got a Luxio. Wow! I actually already have this card. This is my first double of a rainbow. At least when it comes to Pokemon Full Arts. I'm sorry I'm not excited about it. I did pull this in the live stream, so it's not the gold Arceus, but hey, I'll still. Hey, it's a pull. Sorry for not being excited about it. If this was my first time pulling it, I'd be happy. But that's alright. That's alright, hey. And we end up a hit for Brilliant Stars. Got Charizard to begin it. And the god itself, Arceus, to end it. So guys, let me move all these cards off this side. Hey, put these over here. Put these over there. And we're going to open up the Monferno V Showcase Box. Now these boxes can be hit or miss. Seems like I've had decent luck with more with the um, Lost Origin packs, not so much the Astral Radiance packs, because you only get one Astral Radiance, but you get two Lost Origins. And this is actually my first, you know, my first place to get was Fandar. I have yet to get them at Walmart. And it's crazy, I'm the day before the, the set was officially released, too. But I don't know, I think I, I, could, I could get lucky, hopefully. Hopefully get something good out of these, or get nothing, because nice collection boxes, tins... You get a good look at that Infernape. I'm just going to leave it in the in the cardboard for now. I'll take it out of the cardboard later. Yeah, these boxes can be hit or miss sometimes. But anyways, guys, there's that Infernape code if it wants it. Move the cardboard off to the side. So like I said, we've got Astral Radius and Lost Origin. You know what? Let's do Lost Origin because I'm still holding out for that Misty card in Astral Radiance. That Starmie V Alt Art. I'd be so happy if I pull it. It's too bad my pal Jero Productions is not here with me. One of these days, I'm going to schedule a recording with him. We do live stream together, but I might do a recorded video at some point. I'll have to talk with him about it, and we'll try to do something through StreamYard or Restream. Just whatever we can do to record it so we can actually have it up here on YouTube through my channel. or Well, mostly through this channel, because we're not going to do any, any other live streams over on RT and JP Live Channel. But anyways, guys, Dark Type Energy. Have us a Viper. Glare and Stumfisk. Bronzong. Squovit, Phalanx, Poliwag, Oddish, Hysulian Growlithe, Manager Reverse Hollow, so nothing too good. Alright, alright. Aerodactyl V Star, okay, we'll take it. As I just mentioned earlier with PokeRev not pulling that Alt Art Aerodactyl, but uh, I've shot TV, actually pulled it, not just once but twice, but hey, Aerodactyl V Star, I will take it, put it back here. So there you guys go. There's a code for you guys. So, so far, one hit in this box. Don't know if I'll get our hits after that, but we'll see. As we open the second Lost Origin pack with the shiny Gardevoir or Radiant Gardevoir on the front. And it'd be cool if I pull one of those Radiant cards. I've, I've been lucky to pull like some Radiance in Astral Radiance, but we'll see if I can do it in Lost Origin. Alright, guys. Got a Water Type Energy, Torkoal, Erezu. I don't know how, if I didn't pronounce that name right. We got Porygon, which is one of the new Lost Zone Pokemon cards. Rhyhorn, Apom, Rosalia, Gumi, Metatite, No Trainer Gallery card. That's alright, got a Wind Up Arm, and a Greedent, Non Hall Rare. So, we got more pack here to go to end the video. And, um, my hopes aren't very high right now. Not saying it can't happen, but... Oh, the Misty. She seems... She, besides being right there, obviously, she seems to be out of reach for me for the time being. And I don't want to drop 40 bucks on eBay right now just to pull... To, to buy one card, obviously, unless I really, really have to. Because I want that card. But anyways, guys, last hack magic. Grass up energy. Hysulia heavy ball. Per ugly. Uxy. Ralts. Mischievous. Hysulia Sneasel. Barboach. Pon oh, hold on. Maybe, nope, nope. I don't want to. Nope. We got Ponyard. Well, first. Wait and see Turbo. No Misty. And a Miss Magius. Not horror. Sorry, guys. I was, 
I kind of wanted to see what was in the back because I was like, oh, maybe we'll have Misty in the, in the or at least a trainer gallery card in the middle. But nope, not today. Maybe next time. But hey, some good pulls here. So let me get everything organized here, obviously. The best pull will always be, well, we know who the best pull is. So hold on just a moment. So yeah, obviously, not a bad opening. Torterra Hall Graphic, that's one good, decent card. Lapras V, I know, not too exciting, but that's all right. One Trader Gallery pull, a Rangaroo, one of our yacht, but that's cool. Rainbow Arcus V Star, I know, be more excited if it's my first time pulling it, but hey, cool. Why not, you know, trade bait. But here we go. Never can go wrong with a Charizard. One down, four more to go in Brilliant Stars, plus one in Lost Origin. And hey, still one to get in the Pokemon Go set, and well... That's just to name a few. I mean, I still gotta get the Dark Display Charizard. I still need to get the one Shine Fates. And the list goes on and on. But guys, thanks for watching. Rock on, keep collecting, and as always, stay safe.